ain't throwing shade, she just make a touchdown. Scoring on you, she real life. She got her own car in her own crib. She don't take no hand out. She don't. Hey, what's up, you guys? It's your girl Lachelle, aka Miss LA. And I'm gonna start off by putting on this Ace Butte lip pencil and peachy and throw a little lip gloss on because my lips looking a little dry right now so while i'm doing this you ladies can get your wine ready because we're about to have a little girl talk right now and the girl talk is going to be about staying in control while dating that's what we're going to talk about so this look came from boxy charm i get this every month and they have like makeup or whatever uh let's see it's like a nude color uh, let's see how this works and i'm gonna put a little gloss on but anyways yeah i get this from boxycharm and they send me like samples every month so i'm trying this out and yeah whatever it's okay it's like a nude lip liner so yeah that's that if you want to sign up for boxy charm just go on boxycharm.com and yeah you can sign up it's like monthly beauty boxes i love it so far it has really great products um so yeah let's get right into it so today we're going to talk about staying in control while dating hope you got your drinks because we're gonna toast to this So everybody know dating in LA is so hard dating everywhere is really hard and like me I don't know if you like me but I fall in love easily and it doesn't always pay to have your heart on your sleeve sometimes you got to know when to have your heart on your sleeve and you have to know when to be logical you know what I'm saying so I'm gonna go over five things that will help you balance like catching feelings and staying and just going with the pace of dating instead of just putting your whole heart in okay so first when you meet somebody i know us girls we want to romanticize everything oh my gosh i love him we start texting our girls we start going in the group chat but baby girl don't do that don't romanticize every single guy that you meet and start planning your wedding and start telling all your friends. Wait like two weeks to see if you even like this dude because he might do something stupid and you don't even like him next week. And don't have expectations. I'm not saying don't have standards. What I'm saying is don't expect them to catch you if you fall because people always look out for their own self-interest. And that goes for guys, too. They look out for their self-interest. So you look out for your self-interest and have your hobbies, live your life, and don't have any expectations. He can't go out? Okay, cool. I got something to do anyways. You know what I'm saying? Have your own life. And two, like sometimes when you meet a guy, they try to like nitpick at you. They're like, let me see how confident she is. Let me see how... If I can get to her, let me see if she is easily swayed. So, if you say something, stick to what you said. Like I said what I said and I meant what I meant. You know what I'm saying? Because that shows confidence and you know yourself. If they try to be like, oh, I don't like them. I don't like the way you do this and you do that. Okay, well, this is me. Either you're going to accept me wholeheartedly or you're going to dip. You know what I'm saying? So, stay confident when they nitpick at you ignore it be like ha, 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 okay swing your hair period because you are who you are and you did what you did and you said what you said so stay confident and three this is a big one have a roster of guys you need to have james kenneth deshaun roman everybody i'm not saying have sex with these guys because that's being a hoe but don't ever put all your eggs in one basket because that's just not gonna work because you're gonna be like oh my gosh i'm thinking about him what is he doing what is he doing if roman want to take you on a date roman i'm coming on the date 
if Roman want to go to the beach, Roman, I'm coming on the beach. Deshaun can wait later. You know what I'm saying? Like, balance it. Balance it. You don't, like I'm saying, like I said earlier, you don't have to be a hoe. Don't, I don't condone that at all. Keep your legs shut, as a matter of fact. But always have a roster to fall back on. Number four. <laughs> Mirror his actions. And what I'm saying by that is don't be the first to just throw everything out there, pour all your feelings out to him and send these long text messages. Mirror him. If he says he likes you, say, oh, I like you too. Then you can tell. If he is being more receptive to you and opening up about his past, open up about yours like mirror his actions so you know it goes slow and at his pace and you don't feel stupid for talking too much and that's one thing that a lot of girls do they talk too much sometimes you just gotta keep it chill just be chill go with the flow if he asks you a question ask ask the question but you gotta maintain a little mystery you know what i'm saying and number five to stay in control baby girl you have to be ready to go. And what I mean by ready to go, you have to have that air of, if they mess up, I'm leaving. On to the next. Have that mystery that they don't know what they're going to get into. Dang, if I, fuck, if I mess up, she's going, she's serious. She's going to not talk to me. And the thing about that is when you have that air of ready to go, people going to act right. They're going to treat you right. Hmm, drink to that. Mm. I felt that. But yeah, be ready to go. Stick to your standards and don't ever, ever, ever <laughs> go back on your word. If you leave, then leave. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, so that's what I have to say about staying in control of your dating life. You don't want to get too wrapped up in a person who is not wrapped up in you and be hurt. And I know it's, easier said than done but hopefully these five things can really help you to stay a little more detached don't say too detached because you still want some you still want to date you know what i'm saying but don't get too into it so i hope i helped some of you ladies this is my experience take what i'm saying at your leisure but yeah until next week Money throwing shade, she just make a touchdown. Scoring on you, she real life. She don't got her own car in her own crib. She don't take no handouts, she don't own.